Now our next story may be a little controversial for tennis players watching. You see, I'm a fan of pickles. I love dill pickle chips. I even love picklebacks. Look it up, they're delicious. But the most popular pickle in Halton is now pickleball. This summer, this summer activity is taking the region by storm, and Nikki Wesley has more. So spring has sprung and around Burlington, athletes are heading out to pickleball courts. Now I myself have never played pickleball, but I'm here with Mandy Kerr of the city of Burlington and she's going to tell us a little bit about what it's all about. Everything's about pickleball these days. Pickleball is the sport, it's the age friendly sport that anybody can play and learn in a very short amount of time. It only takes about two hours and we're going to get you ready to go in no time at all, Nikki. What do I need? All right, well, you are dressed perfectly for it. Anything that's comfortable for you to wear is all you need. We recommend that you have a court shoe if you can. If not, a running shoe will do, and that's really it. And all of the equipment that you need, you can pick up very easily at most local stores. But uh, we also have a lending library where you can pick up and borrow for free everything you need, including a pickleball net, a paddle, and all of the balls. Tom Wietrich had the daunting task of coaching me. He started off demonstrating a proper serve. Stand behind the line, and all we're going to do is ensure that when we're hitting the ball, the ball is going to be hit with an upward motion below our waist. Okay. Okay, and what we're attempting to do is try to hit it cross court. So not okay. in directly across from us, but cro across the court so at, to our opponent. At our camera. That's right. We're All going right. right at the camera. Okay. okay. It's a simple right. game that can be played anywhere from your driveway to one of the public courts around the city. Recently, new courts were added to Ireland Park. They currently have dedicated pickleball times as part of a new year-long pilot project. This is like tennis slash ping pong, so are my, is it hitting off the ground? Do I have to keep it in the air? How does that work? Absolutely. The ball bounces on the ground. We're supposed to hit it, but then after that, everything's open, meaning you can hit it out of the air, you can smash it, you can do all different types of moves. Now we're in the non-volley zone and we're dinking. All right. Usually play in pairs. Uh, the first team that is serving is going to start from one square. It's going to be serving a cross court into the other square. Um, every time you score a point, you're going to switch sides with your partner, um, and you continue that until somebody reaches the 11. When it's 10, when it's close to 10, obviously yellow pickle. That means you know this final score. Next point wins. So it's a lot of fun that way. Pickle. One important rule, though, is if a ball does go errantly across court into another court, we're supposed to yell, ball, yell it out loud to ensure that other players stop playing so that it doesn't create any injuries or somebody might fall over on the ball. So, Good game. Good game. Thanks so much for Absolutely. the lesson. So you're obviously going to want to give pickleball a try now. There are courts all around the city, both indoor and outdoor. If you're playing outdoor, it's first come, first serve. And if you're playing outdoor and there are folks waiting, make sure you're courteous. Only stay on that court for 30 minutes. For more information and for information about where you can take a lesson, go to burlington.ca slash pickleball. Reporting for Halton News, I'm Nikki Wesley.